Hey guys, this is Alessandro. Welcome back to my channel. And before I start this second part of the tutorial, I just want to make sure, guys, that for this specific tutorial, always make sure you look your animation from different angle and not just from you know reference angle or whatever. Uh, this is because, guys, in such a simple assignment, when you're doing a simple walk cycle, nothing too extreme here. Uh, there is no reason why you should cheat camera with the uh, weight, stuff like that, so it looks ugly from every other angle, right? So as you can see, even when I did the blocking, I was kind of very conscious that my poses and stuff like that look kind of okay from uh, from every uh, possible angle, right? Especially from the beginning where the body started to, you know, go down and stuff like that. It needs to look good from, you know, uh, other angle as well, all right? So keep this in mind and enjoy the rest of the tutorial. See ya. First things we're going to do, guys is to go and obviously switch from step mode to spline okay um i'm gonna start as usual with the very first uh part here okay, i'm gonna start with the very first section 30 46 frame all right and um, going from here the very first things i want to see normally is the generally the, the very first things i want to tweak a little bit is the up and down all right um I will ignore for now the the popini right stuff like that uh but i want to see if uh, i can exaggerate a little bit more i right, did the up and down here boom boom yeah pushing it here a little bit more right okay yeah, maybe here I wanna, wanna go, go down a bit more. Okay. This push a little bit higher. Well, actually, I think it's the net. No, it's this one. The, the one needs to be a little bit higher. All right, let me, let me go here. Oh, by the way, I think here I accidentally. Yes, I accidentally moved everything. And sorry, let me go back here, guys. Yeah, a little bit higher. Boom. So you can have a little bit of... Uh, and as you can see, there is a bunch of popping in. Now I'm not going to worry too much about it. Okay. I want to feel the body going down boom, before going forward, right? All right. Now that this more or less, I think, is done, uh, I want to go and check here the acceleration of how it's moving forward. And as you can see, guys, we, I think we can kind of small now, small cases like this that just create a little bit of imperfection, I think, can be deleted, right? Without, without no, uh, no issue here, right? Uh, but I, what I do want to delete are the contact poses, right? Uh, so I want to delete this one and here again, something like this, all right? Okay, and the very first things here, I want to start to also look at the, um, okay, so yeah, I want to see here how the weight is going this direction. Um, I don't think here I want to stay, go there. Maybe I want to continue this here, right? I think there I just made a mistake overall. Um, Okay, boom, boom. And here, kind of work a little bit more on the easy in, easy out. Okay. Okay, boom. Start to go around here. Maybe here a little bit more to the center. Boom, boom. Other things I want to do is to, uh, you know, check rotation here okay, rotation here i think there's not much to, to adjust 
Okay, this is the rotation up and down here. I don't think this today's amount needs to be adjust. Um, yeah, same amount here. All right, so I think this part is kind of did a really good job during the blocking plus. Now the other things I want to do is uh, definitely the rotation overall here, right? I want to make sure. Yeah, this one maybe has a little bit more of uh, easy out here, okay? And so oh, yeah, portion it like this. Oops, well, that's not what I wanted to do. And here, and yeah, maybe do the acceleration here, and here. right? Boom, boom. All right. Now that we adjust this one, guys, very quickly, um, I want to work on the angle here. All right, on this angle overall here. And so I want to make sure here the this one kind of continue to push that way. Okay, maybe also, yeah, pushing a little bit more forward. Okay. Okay, the weight here, see there's a mistake here. The weight here is supposed to stay here. Okay, releasing. And boom here, pushing here this direction, boom, push it, push it. This should stay like this. Right. And so once we adjust the hip, uh, you realize guys that this is affecting the uh the stretchiness of the knee, right? So boom. I wanna I wanna double check now if these things doesn't affect. How much are we, I'm overstretching here? So I think I can just bring down a little bit more um, this one. Okay. And something like this I can do. But maybe at the same time, I need to then bring down this one a little bit more. To have a little bit of extra contrast. Um, yeah, same stuff maybe here in this case I can just raise this one a little bit more. You can see just a tiny bit. Alright. So now that I've done I've done this one. So and now all of this is done, I'm going to start to work with this, okay, with, with the foot. See, I, I had the foot kind of uh, tilting a little bit here. Boom, boom. I think here I want to just continue to tilt a little bit. And maybe a little bit of easy in, easy out. We started to pull up like this. Okay. And the other things that I want to do here is to boom very, very quickly. Okay. And you want to have this compression a little bit here. Pushing a little bit more. Here, when you do this one, maybe pushing it, pushing it a little bit. Okay. And, and obviously, what we're going to do, we're going to double check here. Okay, boom, 
gonna do this one. We're gonna adjust this one over here, right? I don't see any major uh, problem in this area. Uh, here I wanna go and double check this one. Okay, I wanna see what's going on here. Okay, so I'm raising it a little bit here. I wanna leave it here. Okay, that's kind of fine. Okay, and here obviously this one we want to keep it flat. That's kind of uh, normal, I would say. Here, yeah, we want to see what's happening here. Okay, so here when I tilted it a little bit, no, we want to just make sure it doesn't feel too abrupt. And same stuff here overall. Okay. Then we want to double check here, here more or less pretty straightforward, nothing much. And then guys, I want to start to take a look at the um, sorry, controller here. I want to see the acceleration. Yeah, I think here, this one needs to be a little bit more forward. Yeah. Okay. I'll take a look at the up and down. I want to keep it a little bit higher. Right, and other things I want to take a look is the uh, movement. There is a little bit of movement on the side. Okay, set here, and boom, 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 boom. You're gonna move a little bit on the side here, just a tiny bit. Actually, oh, actually, doing it like this in order to make it work. I have to do it like this. Okay, and same things for the rotation. Okay, I think I want to keep it slightly down. Okay, and come here. Boom. Right, now that this everything is done, let's build this one here. Right, I'll do the same um, overall here. All right, so we're gonna start in here and see what's going on around this area. Yeah, if this needs to be like this, this maybe you wanna uh, have it a nice easy in. Okay. I wanna push it too much. We have this one here, this is fine, we're gonna do this later. And uh, yeah, here also seems there is not a major, maybe a tiny bit here of easy in. Just make very little difference to, to be honest with you. Okay, boom. Again, same stuff here, if you wanna move this one a little bit more on the side. Okay, and adjust the rotation. Those little details. Okay. Boom. Maybe a little bit too much. We push them on the side. Too much. Right. Okay. First part is done. Uh, well, we're missing obviously the. Um, but first of all, see now what I'm doing all this, now I'm realizing, oh, what? Um, uh, it's maybe moving down too much, right? Well, once you start to polish, you realize that some things you need to, um, you know, take them down a little bit. Yeah, so you feel like, ah, oh, this is way too much. Okay. Okay, maybe actually here. This could be a little bit higher. And maybe here again. OK, 
okay and this is good but once all this is done guys i want to go and clean the uh popini i'm gonna start with this one uh, so i don't want to have the knee popping back uh, so much Then I want to do it, adjust it here. And a bit here. Maybe a tiny bit here. Okay. And then I'm going to do the same. Uh, well, actually, let's do one. Uh, the process is going to be kind of the same. Right. And okay. Take simulation. I'm going to go here. And I'm gonna check what what is going on. Okay. Um, so overall, I would say this one. I, I would keep it this way. I want a minimum uh, poppiness of the knee around this area. Okay. Okay, more, 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 more. As you can see, there is, there is a problem uh, around here. Okay, we're adjusting this one here. Okay, uh, we have the problem here. Okay, on this area, we have it here where we don't want to. Um, right. Adjust it kind of like here. Okay, maybe a little bit back in here and so on, but I think you're getting the point, guys. All right, guys, I'm gonna move to the uh, last part of the of the polish. Okay, I didn't do the middle part because as I mentioned, it's just basically repeating the same step over and over. Didn't want to drag this tutorial for way too long. Um, and so I'm gonna do this last one. So before I start to polish, as you can see, this last section here, um, I think like it's speeding up a little bit too much. And so I want to kind of slow down a little bit. Maybe like a frame here and there. Okay, boom. Go here. And then kind of maybe around. And yeah, I kind of slow down till here. Okay, and now stop here. All right, so what we're gonna do starting now for this part is that how, you know, the body needs to decelerate. Uh, and yes, also some kind of acceleration. Deceleration is not very necessarily just linear the way he um, decelerates. Okay, guys, so Windows. Predator, I'm gonna go here. And as you can see, yes, so from this key on, I want to kind of decelerate um, a little bit until here. Okay, there is a little bit of deceleration, right? Until until this moment, I would say. Okay. Then we have like a, a quick acceleration here when it's going up, right? You have one at this moment here. Okay, make sure it's not too abrupt, and then we kind of ease out here. And boom. Boom. Here, right? And then here, like a full a full stop, okay? Boom. Boom, boom. Now see that the shift here it's happening is it's very very subtle here right 
then I'm, I'm just adjusting it a little bit more. So I'm gonna hold it here a little bit longer before it was a little bit too even. A bow, hope, All right? So I wanna make sure that those movement, they, they do not feel way too even, okay? And as you can see now, there is a lot of popping in problem. Again, we are ignoring this kind of stuff at this stage, right? Um, we wanna first uh, um, adjust the overall pelvis movement, all right? And here we wanna see what is going on here. So, so I think here this needs to start to move forward a little bit more, okay? Kinda ease out here, boom. Be here, kind of pushing down a little bit more to the center because you know you're bringing your weight a little bit behind here. Okay, the movement is, is kind of moving in an arc, right? Right, right. And I think here it needs to be yeah, more like this. Is out more like this. Okay, something like that. I'm gonna see if maybe we can clean up this one a little bit more. Okay. Okay, so just in this part here. I think this part needs to be, yeah, kind of like this. And started to shift a little bit early. All right? So we're adjusting things like here. And I want to make sure I also adjust this part overall here. And put a key here. Actually, maybe it's not here, it's on the, on the Y axis. Okay, All right. All right, I'm just in this section overall here. I'm gonna then look at the up and down. All right, uh, now that I adjust those arc. Uh, let me adjust this one. Okay. I'll take a look at the up and down here because now obviously we're gonna have you know the down position here, right? Up pos passing position up. Okay, maybe I went a little bit too much. Uh, okay, pushing down here, maybe a little bit less here. Okay, I see, I see I want a way too, too high, I think, overall here. Okay, I'm coming up here. Okay, boom. Boom, coming down here. Boom, push it like this, okay. Maybe this one is a little bit more here. Boom, boom, boom. Yes, feels a little bit better. All right. And other things, now I wanna take a look at this. Uh, here seems to break forward. Um, same stuff here. If, if you did the blocking correctly, it was just about uh, smoothing out those um, those things. Um, here, as you can see, towards this last step, the body started to shift this direction. Okay. Um, so 
just about you know make sure again this acceleration deceleration is not too um too flat right maybe a little bit of overshoot stuff like that okay boom and now i want to go here on this one uh, again one more time i go from here we're keeping the weight here boom boom i want to push this one down right boom 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 okay started to push it up here okay Okay, boom, and pushing it up here. All right. The rotation, I think, is stop moving after. See, the rotation of the hip during the walk cycle is kind of stop moving here because now the these things are kind of in the middle. Okay. So we have the entire. But you can still do a little bit, but I think for this tutorial, um, yeah, it's kind of clean enough. All right. So now what we're gonna do now that the lap uh, that this part is two controls are done, they're gonna uh, uh, you know work on the feet, right? Boom. Wanna start to work on this first section, right? Go here. Wanna see what's going on? Uh, again, see like a very very uh, flat here. Okay, over here there is no, this one should be flat, yep. Um, okay, here very quick uh, acceleration, that's fine. Uh, yeah, and here we're gonna do this one, I think this one we get rid of it. And yeah, see so this one can slowly start it to move. Okay, and from here, Maybe you can start slowly tilted this way. Okay. And adjust it a little bit more. So you see here that the leg is kind of like this. So I want to continue to tilt this way. Um, right. And maybe adjust it a little bit more. Okay. Okay, boom. Okay, and maybe here I wanna just wanna keep it flat for now. Okay. Okay, some stuff here again. Could be push, not so overall. I want it to be less. Boom, boom. Okay, boom. Here again, I do have the feeling that this is things is going way too up. Maybe it's this section here. Okay. Okay. Maybe here we can just okay. And I hold this a little bit more. Okay, we're gonna remove all the weird popping. Don't worry, guys, about it. 
Um, boom. Then the other things we're gonna do here, this one is gonna, yeah, close very quickly. Boom. There is something here look like it's gonna go under the ground. So I wanna remove that. Okay, so and I also want to push a little bit here. Boom. Boom. Okay, then that's it. All right, so we want to. Okay, move it here, clean it up. Okay, boom. Yeah, here look, there is not much needs to be done. Think of obviously, guys, you can continue to use your skill to, you know, continue to refine and stuff like that, right? And now the only thing as you we need to do um, is to. First of all, guys, keep all those stuff here for the knee, right? As you can see now, there is a lot of poppy knees. So what we're gonna do here is, you know, I set certain key, right? And again, wanna make sure it doesn't overstretch too much, right? Boom. So here, for example, when it's snapping here, it's gonna snap him back a little bit too much. Okay, and then again here, maybe a little bit too much forward. Okay, push him back, push him back. See here, and here. Okay, gonna stay like this. And I'm gonna do the same here. Right, bo, bo. Push it forward. Okay, boom. Okay, this is what I wanna bend it way too much. Okay. Okay, this one gonna keep it like this. Okay, just it here and here, okay? And obviously this, this doesn't fix entirely the problem. What we still need to do is to um, go here, go in a big simulation, right? Then we're gonna go here and clean all, all, all the mess that we can find here. Here is gonna be a little bit of a tedious work, um, but uh, you know, uh, as I showed at the beginning of this tutorial, just, just needs to be done, right? Hey guys, so we completed the full assignment here, like fully polished. And one of the things you notice, and I always recommend it to do, when you saw me doing pause in the blocking, you notice probably how I was checking things from a very angle, because in general, my attitude is no matter what, as much as I can, I like to make animation that can work most of the time for, for every angle, right? Not just from the camera view. Uh, just because, you know, especially if you one day you want to work in games and stuff like that, you want to make sure you're... Uh, things work really nice, um, they look very polished, solid, and can look good from, from every angle. So in case you have to move the camera just a little bit, uh, you know, uh, you are not in trouble. All right, guys, of course, there are always extreme cases where it's okay to cheat to camera, don't get me wrong. Uh, but in general, when you're doing something like this that is quite simple, the, there is no reason here to cheat and to make the character that looks completely unbalanced and doesn't look good from, from another angle, right? It's a simple work cycle. You should be able, guys, to execute something along this quality, uh, you know, with such a simple assignment, right? Especially if you want to move forward uh, to more difficult things. Okay, guys? See you next time. I hope you enjoy. Bye, guys.